everyone, Dan here from the Time of Minecraft. Welcome back to another episode of Minecraft Pocket Edition, where today we are back inside the house without a roof. Welcome back, everyone. How are you doing? I hope you're doing good. So, what I've done today is, well, what did we do last time? Well, last time we built a boat, and um, I built a dock that was too small, and what else did I do? Oh, yeah, I got a spider called Sam who ended up trying to kill me. I didn't enjoy that whatsoever, so let's go back into normal mode, and I've done a little bit off camera, just a little, little bit, and um, I've got some more wood. Oh, we made a compass as well, just in case I need to find my way back, which I might need to do today. I need to stop, um, stop sneaking as well. Oh, I need to, um, quickly grab some food, because I went out and just slayed a couple of cows, because... I need their leather anyway, and I've got two. Fantastic. That's, uh, that's appalling. Absolutely appalling, because I want to work towards an enchanting table pretty soon, because the longer I take to make an enchanting table, the more opportunity I have to die and lose my levels again. So, um, <laughs> that is why I want to make one as quickly as possible. And what did I have in here? I had five steak and also some cooked chicken as well. So let's munch upon this steak. There we go. Beautiful, beautiful steak. Okay, right. Let's get out of here, and I'll show you what I've been doing. So I bred a few more animals. I also extended my farm out because I just need as much wheat as I can get because I'm going to run out of meat soon. So I need to eat wheat instead, or bread, as you can imagine. And also made um, some more animals. Got a new cow. Um, the sheep is still kind of disobeying me. And we've got a new little sheep as well. Where is he? There he is. I thought I lost him for a sec. There you go. Munching up grass like it's nobody's business. And we still got just four pigs because I um I destroyed the carrots and it only gave me two. So I had to replant one and um put one in my inventory, I guess. Is it still there? Yes, it's still there. Look, it's over here. There it is. Um, oh, geez, didn't mean to do that. Right, let's grab this. So today, what I wanted to plan on doing is going and grabbing that over there, which is some sugar cane, and then just walking in one direction to see if we can find a village. Now, I know that's going to be very, very rare to happen, but it's the easiest way to find books. So that is the way that I want to do it, because just finding leather and sugar cane is really, really long, especially once when you want to make a massive, um, like, fully formed enchanting room. It's very difficult. So that's what we're going to do today. Now, do we have enough time to do it now uh where's the sun sun where are you sun are you going down yes you are you are going down so i am going to just chill around here oh also made the dock a little bit bigger to put my boat in because i messed it up last time i didn't make it big enough because the boat needs a three wide gap to get through so i did that too and what i'm going to do now is real quick just um quickly scope out one of these caves i've got any torches i got two wow two really just two. Uh, actually, while we're here and waiting for the sun to go down, so we've got a full fresh day, what I want to do is make a roof, which um, I should have done a long, long time ago. So um, how much wood have I got? I've got quite a lot. So I'm just going to make it out of slabs because what I want to do is put the enchanting room on the roof. I like doing that just because it saves space and it's quite awesome as well. That is why. That is why. So um, let's grab, what am I doing? Um, oak wood planks and then I want to make some slabbies. There we go. I'm not sure how many we're going to need. Um, we've got 29. That should be enough. But I also need to make some ladders as well. Just uh, three, though. Um, how many do I need? I need some sticks. Okay. Why can't I make sticks? Oh, have I got none of these left? Wow. Um, right. Oh, jeez. What am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? Um, I've messed up. Okay, so I've got nine. I just need to make some sticks. There we go. Everything keeps chopping and changing. There we go. So I just need enough for three ladders. I don't think I need more than that. Let's grab these ladders. There we go. Uh, where should we put the ladders? Um, I'm thinking like here, but then it kind of breaks up the whole, the whole thing. Um, I don't know where to put these. I guess I could put it just here. That would kind of work. Yeah, I'm going to do that. Let's put ladders up here. Yeah, that's not too bad. And then we got some... Oh, jeez. That's in the way. That's in the way. That's in the way. You know what? I'm just going to make it so that it's up one. Yeah, let's do that instead. Okay, right. I'm just going to need to make these all the way across and not blocking there. The only problem if we do that, though, is that it's not going to fit on if we build stuff on top of it. So I'm just going to make one a little bit higher, which is this one here. And then we should be able to just pop that. Oh, we can't put that on top either. No, it's because we've got the slabs there already. I thought I was being so smart with those. Okay, let's just make it um, not as high for the rest. Why am I trying to hoe the dirt? That doesn't really, the, the wood, that doesn't really work, does it? Um, okay, let's put that there. We're finally getting a roof. Oh my goodness, how long has it taken me? What episode is this? Episode 9? And it's about 30 minutes per episode, or 25. That's a lot of, um, that's a, a fair few hours without any kind of, um, without any kind of roof. I'm surprised we've survived this long without one. We will make this a little bit nicer later down the line, but for now, just need it to be as functional as possible. So let's build... Ah! Ah! Did you... You! You shot me off my own roof. 
How rude was that? Jeez. <laughs> I was like, what is going on? Did something just spawn? Oi, Buster. Buster, come here. Come here, where is he? Where is he? I can't see him. I can't see him. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. Um, I really need to build like a bow and arrow or craft one even because I need to just like get on my roof and just start attacking things. There he is. Ah! I can't get him from here. Oh, jeez. I need to lure him around to the front door. I need to light up the, um, I need to light up the river a bit somehow. I might have to put some torches on my dock. I need to check that there's nothing else around here because if a creeper walks in, I'm going to be so upset. Right, Skelebone, where are you? Where are you? Come here. Skelebone. Skelebone. Oh, there he is. There he is. There he is. Let's chop him. Chop him. Chop him. Chop him. Oh, uh, yes. There we go. Get out of here. Right. Let's see if we can sleep now. It's a bad idea to start building at night, wasn't it? Uh, I thought it was such a good idea as well. There we go. Woo! We're almost done with the roof. I just need to craft some more um, slabs and then we should be good to go. So let me just uh, make some more. Just need some. I'm just going to make all these. Uh, how much do I have? I have six. Yeah, I'm just going to make all those into wooden planks. Uh, actually, I might not. There we go. 17. That should be able to finish it off, right? Or am I just being, like, really under-conservative? Yep, I'm being under-conservative. There's a spider back again. Sally, I thought I killed you. I thought I killed you, but apparently not. Okay, it's a very simple roof, guys. I might make the floor glass, actually. That could be quite cool. But for now, go there, go there. Oh, there's a torch there. Get out of here. Um, There we go. Nice long reach with them arms. Oh, have I got just enough? Have I got the perfect amount? I might do. Three, four... Uh, yeah, I have. Oh, yes, look at that. That's perfect. Okay, I need to put this somewhere now. I'm just going to put it here for now. Because now I am I'm caved in, which is beautiful. So, this doesn't look as good anymore. Maybe I should have made it one higher. Oh, that's annoying. That's annoying. Anyway, I'll fix that for next time. We can always uh, sort that out later. So, now that we've slept, what we can do is... Actually, I'm going to grab some coal and make some torches real quick. How much have I got on me? Uh, none. Okay, let's grab some coal. We need, I don't know, like five, I guess? Let's make some torches. One, two, three. We should be able to make a couple more than that. Uh, that should be fine for now, though. Right, I'm going to get out of here. So where is our house? I'm going to use this compass to find our way back. So, wait a second. I'm going to run over here. This spider should leave me alone. Please leave me alone. Please leave me alone. Thank you. That's much appreciated. <laughs> so if I want to head back to here, where will I need to go? Currently, I am heading in a, just a, a southeast direction. So I need to head... Not, uh, oh, no, I need to head east to get home. Okay, I'm just going to run in a straight line because there's planes all the way along here. And hopefully, this works because I need to find somewhere more interesting. I need to find... Well, I'm looking for a village, which I mentioned earlier. So we're going to do a little bit of a, a village hunt right now. Um, oh, I thought there was going to be a cave there. Jeez. I'm um, you... You zombie, you're all on fire and stuff. Get out of here. There we go. I'll take your experience. That's okay. <laughs> I'll take your experience and munch it all up. So what I'm going to do is just literally run forward and maybe I can find some kind of village. It'd be good to get a villager back somehow as well. But if it's not that close, then I don't think we'll be able to. Let's keep running forwards. Uh, chop these down. Get out of here. Ugh! There we go. Get out of here. Oh, man. It had to be more complex than it needed to be, didn't it? There's a forest all the way around here. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to keep going. Hopefully, I will not get lost, because there's no way to get coordinates on this at all. There's no maps in this version of Minecraft either, so you can't even use a map. So a compass, we're going old school and using a compass instead. But we have to just head in that direction. That direction. That should be okay. So what I'm going to do is keep on running, and then uh, if I come across something, I'll see you guys as soon as that happens. Let's hope that's very, very soon, because... I'm not sure what's going to happen. <laughs> yes, that's what I'm talking about. Look at it. It's right in front of us. We got one. Oh, man. You know what? I didn't have to go as far as I thought. Now, I am a little bit off course. So hopefully I can find my way home. But what I managed to do is actually gather quite a lot of beef. I managed to get three leather as well, which is one book, I guess. But hopefully, ah, oh, look, there's path here as well. I forgot this. Please don't be a terrible village. Please don't be terrible. I'm looking for books. I'm looking for books, but I don't know if I'm going to get any. Oh, jeez, this isn't looking good. This isn't looking good. Um, no books in there. Hello, sir. How are you doing? He's running away. He's like, nope, nope, I don't want to see you right now. Um, there is a lot of uh, rain as well, which isn't good. Okay, we did find a village, which is good, actually, because we can grab all of this, too. Um, let's grab all of this. There we go. What was that? Okay, it's all good. It's all good. Right, let's grab all this. It doesn't look very ripe, so I don't think we're going to get any wheat from it. But at least we'll get seeds, I guess. So we're just going to ramsack this village. 
There we go. I don't think there's any crops that are actually ready to go yet. And I can't... Now that it's raining, it's really annoying because I can't actually tell what time it is. Which is quite annoying, which means I can't kind of tell when I need to go home desperately. Oh, this is a terrible village. Oh, man, I really thought I'd found a good one. There's no books here whatsoever. There's no books. Oh! Okay, we found this, though. We found it. Right, let's grab these. These are beetroots. Now, these are exclusive to Minecraft Pocket Edition, which is pretty crazy. Now, I think if we grab these, then we should be able to make some some beetroot crops at home. Now, can you eat these normally? I've got five and then some seeds as well. Oh, this is cool. Okay, this is better than I thought it was. At least we got something we haven't had before. So, we found a beetroot village. That's kind of cool, I guess. <laughs> but I was kind of hoping for some books. Turns out it doesn't really want to give me any. And, oh, geez, it's nighttime. It's literally nighttime right now. What I might have to do is craft a bed real quick. I'm going to slay this cow. Um, oh, man, I thought that would have been better. Can you even get bookcases? I don't even know. Might have to do it the old-fashioned way. Um, there are some sheep around here. I need to be really, really quick right now so I can actually sleep here. Because I don't really want to run back. With loads of nasties chasing me, right? I'm sorry, I'm gonna have to take your life, sheep. Get out of here. Get out of here. There we go. Right, we got one. Um, yes, there's three. Thank goodness. Give me that. Give me that. Give me that. So we have got a nice selection of food as well because, oh jeez, I can see some zombies. Uh, oh no, I can see some zombies. Oh jeez. Right. Um, no, that's not you. I need to kill. I need to kill. Oh no, this is bad. This is bad. This is bad. This is bad. Why did I do this? Why did I do this? Oh jeez. Right. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Um, I'm gonna kill you as well. And I just need to grab this sheep. Man, I've been in so much danger in these Pocket Edition episodes, it's crazy. Okay, I've got what I need. I just need to get inside a house. Hopefully the zombies aren't going to take over just yet. Ah, there's a, there's a spider after me. Oh, jeez. Get in, get in, get in, get in, get in. Yeah, you can't get through this now, can you, punk? There we go. Right, let's light this place up. Um, we're just going to have to stay here for the night, I guess. Um, not really the best, but hey, we can't really complain. Let's go ahead and make a crafting table. Uh, let me grab this and put this down here. Then we need a bed. There we go. Oh, we can make carpet. I completely forgot about that. Completely forgot we had carpets. There we go. Sleep. Yes, it worked. Yes. Quick sleep in the old beetroot village. That's awesome. Okay, right. Let's just stay around here for a second then. Because we're kind of in the same uh, place we were before. Um, villagers, how are we holding up? There's a spider on your roof, but you're okay otherwise. You're looking good, guys. You're looking good. Now, there's nothing down there. What was I doing before I got distracted? I was just slaying some cows. Okay, there's a guy right here that I need to take care of. Get out of here. Get out of here. We're collecting some bones as well, which is good, because I need some uh, bone meal for later on when I'm doing my own farm. Now, I'm kind of annoyed that that, that was a pretty terrible, um, that was a pretty terrible village. I really, really wanted a book. At least we can make an enchanting table, but um, we're not going to be able to make a really good enchantment yet. Which is a little bit annoying. I'm just going to quickly go over here. I know villagers don't usually spawn that close to each other, but I just want to quickly run over here. With the village still in sight, so I know where I am. But mind you, how much have I collected? I've collected eight leather. That's not too bad. That will make, uh, if I kill this and get a leather from this, this will make, how many, how many will this make? Um, three books. Three books. I think it's three leather per book, isn't it? I'm not sure if the, the recipe's any different. Alright, let's take you out as well. Um... We've got some good caves around here, too. Let's have a quick look. Can I still see the village? I need to be very careful not to get lost. As long as the village is there, we know where we are. If I could find, like, a giant ravine so that I can see some diamonds in it, that would be fantastic. Show me that right now. That would be beautiful. I swear I saw a big hole down here. Um, maybe not. Maybe not. Um, there's so many cows. I need to take these cows out. I'm sorry. I feel so bad that I'm slaying all these cows, but it needs to be done. Ugh! Get out of here. For food and for leather purposes. There we go, you and you just watched your friend die and didn't care whatsoever, did you? <laughs> he did not care. I got 12, so that's four books. For a bookshelf, you need three. So you can see how annoying it is to try and get any kind of decent amount of books. Oh man, I'm just going to keep running around here. I need to eat this steak right now. I really want to find another village. Let's hope we can. I don't think they're going to be that close to each other, though. Oh, another thing I noticed that's really, really cute about Pocket Edition is that um, the the pigs, the baby pigs and baby animals, follow their um, their dads and mums around. How cute is that? So I'm not going to kill you, pig. Don't worry. I'm not going to kill you. I guess that's the mum and dad there, proud parents. I'm not going to kill them. That would be very, very harsh to do. Okay, I don't think there's going to be a village over here, is there? No. Um, ugh, I don't know what to do now. I guess we can go back to the village. Um, I don't know if I want to collect my bed or not, or whether I can just keep it there, just in case we die, and then we know where we are. But, yeah, because otherwise it's going to send us back to our normal spawn point, isn't it? And that won't be good. Right, I'm going to try and head back. 
And then I might run in the opposite direction and see if I can find another village that has books. But other than that, we have got beetroot. So what we can do now is make an absolutely epic farm of pretty much everything. We've got wheat. We've got... Oh, melon seeds. I ate all my melons, didn't I? I should have saved them. Melons are so good for food as well. Why did I do that? Why did I do that? Anyway, that, that's, that's in the past. I've eaten the melon. I've eaten the melon. I don't think I've got any in my chest either. I think I ate it all. Ooh, there was another thing I wanted to do as well, but I don't know if I'm going to do it in this episode. It was to eat some golden apples. Not eat them, but make them. Right, let's uh, see. Right, I'm going to run back now, guys. I think this is the way I came. I'm not sure, though. Right, where's that village? The village is... The village is over there. Yeah, the village is that way. So I definitely came this way. I put a torch down, but I don't remember where it was. Oh, jeez. Why do I do this? Why do I do this? Um, right, this is the right way to run, though. So I'm going to run this way. And guys, hopefully, I'll meet you back at home. Otherwise, I'm in big trouble. Again. You know what? I could call myself an actual survivalist. Look, I found home. I was a bit worried that I wasn't going to find it. But, guys, I did it. I bring in the beetroot home. That's what I'm doing. That is what I'm doing. So what I'm going to do now is to sort out a few things at home. And then maybe off camera, I'll walk in different directions. And see if we can find some books. But for now, oh, actually, while I'm on this side of the river, there is some sugar cane over here. So let's quickly go and grab that. Real quick, real quick, real quick. Come on, let's do this. I don't think, did I see anyone else out there? I can't even remember. But there's some sugarcane around here. There it is. Just one little slither of sugarcane. And I want to quickly grab it. Because I'm going to need those for papers. Right, give me this. Go on, grab it. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Give me that. And then we're going to grow that in our own place. Uh, right, I need to run. Run before the Nazis come. Okay. Oh, jeez, there's one over there. There's one over there. There's one over there. One over there. Oh, jeez. Don't get hit. Don't get hit. There's a spider over there, too, which is going to turn any second now. I might have to take it out. I'm going to go this way. Oh, we can grow our sugar cane here. Beautiful. Let's go ahead and pop these down here real quick. Uh, I need to go here, here, and here. And hopefully those will grow pretty quickly because what I want to do in the next episode is actually get this enchanting table made so that we've got enough... Because um, I think we've got enough experience to enchant something, but ideally I would like to wait until level 30 and then enchant a diamond sword. But the only problem with that is I'll need to use my two diamonds that I would have used for a diamond sword for the enchanting table because it requires four obsidian and I think I've got four obsidian. Let me just quickly check right here. Uh, yeah, four obsidian I've got, which is right here. But, um, I need the book. I can make a book now, but I want to wait for that to grow first. Whoa, 34 steak. That's what I'm talking about. Give me all of those. Um, that's not going to work on two coal, though, is it? Let's put two more coal in there. Uh, let's grab some more. Uh, one, two, three. Okay, grab all of it. That's fine. <laughs> and then put the rest in here. Okay, cook all those steaks. So we now got food for days, which means that we don't need to kill any of our cows yet. So that's good. We can actually keep on breeding them. And grab these steaks real quick and munch them real nice. I want to make my roof a little bit taller, but for now, we do actually have a roof, which um, has taken long enough. So I want to make it one higher than this. Uh, so we've got some headroom and things can look pretty awesome. But for now, um, okay, this cow has either joined the party or escaped. I think I need to make my farm a little bit bigger. So I need to make some more fences, but um, this is looking good. And we got some beetroot. Um, did someone go in my farm or did I not have enough seeds? I think someone might have been in my farm, but for now, let me just quickly plant these beetroot seeds. Um, I don't want to fall off this fence, though, because then I fall in. There we go. Beetroots. Okay. Nice. Right. I'm going to try some of these beetroots real quick. Let's see if they, um, they're tasty or not. So I think you can make beetroot stew or beetroot soup. I can't remember. Let's see if we can eat it. We can. Look at that. Yes. I'm not sure what else you can use beetroot for, but that's kind of cool. I like that. So anyway, guys, we did find a village, but unfortunately, it wasn't a village that had any books. So I might try and walk in that direction next time and see if we can find any other village um, with books. But it's still kind of cool. We found some beetroot and we now have a roof. So guys, thank you so much for watching this video. If you did enjoy it, then please do a big fat thumbs up. That'd be greatly appreciated. And also, if this happens to be the first video you've seen by me, then please do consider subscribing to join team TDM today. I hope you're enjoying Daily Pocket Edition and I'll see you guys tomorrow for the next episode. Goodbye! <laughs>